Hey guys, it's Iggy G. Welcome back to another video. I hope you're having fun with the Crown Tundra DLC. I'm here to bring you guys an update. Unfortunately, it's not a good one. Recently, a bug was found that involves the new item, the Ability Patch. I'll leave a link in the description below to the Cerebi forum post if you would like to read it up yourself. For those that don't know, the Ability Patch is a new item in the Crown Tundra. It allows the Pokemon to change its regular ability to its hidden ability. You can purchase the Ability Patch in the Dynamax Adventures Cave from the Lady to the right using 200 Dynite Ore. So the bug is that by using the Ability Patch on Pokemon Court in Generation 3 games or Generation 4 games, those Pokemon will no longer be able to be used online in battles or in raids. As Jamie Boy says in the thread, the hack checker is outdated and will flag these Pokemon as hacked or illegal. This is because hidden abilities did not exist in Generation 3 or Generation 4. Therefore the checker flags these as being hacked. To show it to you guys, I've done some testing myself. So for this example, we're going to the Victory Station and going to the Battle Stadium. We're just going to do Casual Battle and Single Battle for this example. Here you can see Agron is in my party. Agron was caught in Pokemon Emerald Generation 3. As you can see here, it communicates and is now searching for a trainer. But now this is what happens if we use the ability patch to change Agron's ability to its hidden ability. We're going to once again access Victory Station. Hit Battle Stadium and again with casual battles and going for single. We're going to select the same team, with the only change being that one ability change and it tells us that there is a problem. Agron has been flagged here and we're going to try and go into a raid. So I'm going to try joining this raid. It's communicating but I cannot participate because there is something wrong with a Pokemon in my party. It was also reported that this bug affected Pokemon caught in Generation 5. However, I've tested this with a Crustle I caught in Unova Generation 5 and it does not get flagged. It goes through and um, same procedure as well going with the casual battle singles. Searches for an opponent. So we don't get flagged with that one. So guys, Pokemon caught in Generation 3 and Generation 4 that were transferred to Pokemon Sword and Shield through the use of Pokemon Home will be affected by this bug when having the ability patch applied to them. But guys, don't get confused. Pokemon that were introduced in Generation 3 and Generation 4 but were caught in Sword and Shield are fine. I hope Game Freak notices this bug and patches it soon. Or should I say, ability patches it soon. No? no? Uh, okay. You know what? Let's stop the video there. Uh, guys, thank you so much for watching. I hope that it helped you out and kept you informed. Please share it around. Let your friends know. Let your dog know. Let Pikachu know. Uh, yeah, anyway, I'll see you guys in the next video or stream. As always, stay awesome, not toxic. Bye!